Hello, horsey people. How are we all today? Ah, uh, we're back with Horse Reality. One of the best free... Can I just emphasise on the word free? F-R-E-E. -E, uh, game that you can get for horses. It's, it's, it is absolutely cracking, this game. Sorry if my mic's a bit weird. Basically, I still can't figure out how to record... Oh, I don't want my emails up. Uh, how to record OBS through just a desktop. Do you know what I mean? It, it does gaming, but how to actually just get it on like your, your web sort of thing. Who I don't know. I'll figure it out one day. So guys, I am lost. I'm so lost. I don't know what to do on Horse Reality anymore. I'm a bit bored, but I do love the game. So what, uh, what am I doing? I'm wondering if I should sell up and start a whole new breed. Oh, I just feel like that's going to be a bit disastrous. I also want to show you our swanking new stallion. I haven't logged on this for a few days. Uh, when I say a few days, probably a week again. I just work so busy. You know, it's commitment. It's commitment. This is Jacob, guys. Oh my word, look how beautiful he is. Is he a black roan? Let's go to genetics and find out, actually. Yeah. I'm so deselectable. That would definitely help. I'm not really sure what he is, but he is gorgeous. And then I couldn't even remember breeding him. Because I don't think he looked like that as a foal. And I was like, looking at the summary, I was like... I definitely bred that because they're all my horses <laughs> so I was like oh well I bred this which I'm amazed at because he's got high GP and incredible achievements so I'm like well is he the best thing I've ever bred and why have I not made more of him and why have I only called him Jacob <laughs> I quite like the name Jacob reminds me of the Twilight Saga so guys I'm putting him right up for stud he is absolutely stunning Da, 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 da. Oh, guys, I've got that thing stuck in my head. Ba da dee da da lump bum bum. Da 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 da. <laughs> oh, dear. So he's going up and I just wanted to show you him. He's absolutely beautiful. So let's go to that genetics and find out what colouring he is. Right, so he's a. Oh, I don't really know. He's a roan? Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> and he's got on the wiki and, like, go for the colours. Okay, I've read about the colours like thousands of times. I think what would be nice on Horse Reality if they just told you what the colour was. You know, a bit like in Horse Eden eventing, like, even if the name of the colour is really, really long, they tell you the name of it. Where, here, I, I can't be bothered to figure it out. I ain't got time for that. <laughs> so, ain't nobody got time for that. So, hopefully, yeah. Uh, hopefully that'll be a cool edge. Apparently a new breed is coming out for Horse Reality on the 6th of October, so I'm going to be all over that. Charlie! So actually, we need, probably need to sell some horses. We're going to do that today. I love Charlie. He's gorgeous. He is definitely probably one of my favourites. I mean, look at him. He's so handsome. He's got the beautiful roan colouring. Let's go to... I think I already did this today. Because I did actually just try to record something, but uh, went a teeny bit wrong. I don't really know what mucking out means. I mean, how many times do you have to click this for this blue bar to be full? I mean, I've been playing this game for years. Like, probably about two years, and I just haven't done it. Because I can't be bothered. Um, right, let's go through these foals here. Batman. <laughs> like Batman from our rival stars. Let's just check his achievements and stuff. Oh, he's awesome. Okay, well, we're going to put all these ones up for sale today. So you guys, get in there. I'll sell them quite cheap. Uh, so you guys can have a nice, decent horse with a cool colour. Uh, yeah, so we've got quite a few here. I'm wondering if the Brumbies was a bit of a mistake. Maybe I haven't got time to sit down and, like, play this game properly, which is annoying. So I'd rather you guys had all the fun, you know? I might sell up all my horses. I don't know what I'm going to do. Basically, this is a video on asking you guys for your advice. I'm bored with the game because I feel like I've kind of got all the colours on this quarter horse thing. But a quarter horse is easier because there's so many of them. Do you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, and I sound ridiculous today, guys. Yes, I do, because I have a stupid cold and I sound like I'm about 12, which is really, really fun. I can't sell this horse. It's too nice. It's too nice. Too pretty. Oh, dear. Let's have a look at this one. Now, the colouring on this one is incredible, because I don't tend to breed that very much. That's that's quite nice. Uh, if I didn't have 4,000 horses, I probably wouldn't be selling this. But, yeah. Today is decision day, so I don't know what I'm going to call this video yet. It's just you guys wanted me to play Horse Reality. And here we are. I want to show you. I've got a couple of new foals as well. Betty finally bred a foal. And I bred her with... Let's have a look at the foal. Yeah, I bred her with... Let's start basic training while we're here. Yeah, I bred her with Dylan because I love Dylan. So I was hoping that we would breed this kind of... Like, 
colouring here, but we've just got a really, really different uh, four white socks, however, bay. So I was just like, well, that's fine. I guess the colouring's, well, it's not a bay, it's a chestnut, I'm being really stupid. But uh, yeah, let's check his achievements. I haven't checked this yet. Oh, 11. He's nice. And he's got high GP ish too. Wow, I say high GP. I suppose my aim in the game could be trying to breed the highest GP, but I don't know. I, I only ever play games uh, for colouring. I've always done that. Even years ago, you know, playing horse and stuff like that, I've only ever played for the for different colours and stuff like that. And I think that's what let ho lets horse down, actually, is the lack of variation in the colours. Unless they've changed that, but they, they went all weird and made these, like, you know, fairy tale creatures and stuff like that. It's not for me, I'm afraid. But we did a whole video on Slate and uh, Horse anyway, which is a bit mean to me, really, because it is a good game. But I feel like they're a bit money grabbing. And they don't, I don't know. If you, if you play horse, you're into horses, you know? Flame Boy's gorgeous, guys. He's lush. So, uh, this is basically a video just asking you for advice. I'm going to sell some of these guys. I just don't know what to do. This one's a lovely little mare. Oh my gosh, she's 12. Very good. What? Oh my good lord. I haven't even seen half of these because they all aged up without me. Let's call this one. Uh, I'll let you guys name this one. I'm going to call it one. Put one <laughs> equals and then a name. I'm sure we'll have another one. So this is 12. Very good. Some of you guys asked me, like, what does the 12 very good mean? Well, let's put 6-3 something. Oh, I've got short time memory loss. Oh, it's 6-3-6. Six, six. Uh, I'll put you in. Mass, mass. Yeah, so put number 1 equals, because that's quite a weird colour. Is that a grillo? Gr Same colour as blue, I assume, here. Oh, I've got a lovely coffee here, guys. Oh. Yeah, sorry, I haven't filmed my face today, just because I, I, I can't. Um, it's just going to take me to, yeah. Okie dokie dog. Let's check this one. We're checking through our files. Let's see what else we've got. Crikey, another 11. Very good. He's nice. Now, again, as I say to you guys, I've got so many stallions. It's, like, ridiculous. So, I'll sell these off so you guys can, you guys can have them, enjoy them, start your own lines and stuff. But I think I'm, I just want to... Yeah, I think it's like they need to bring in a new breed, which they are doing. They're bringing in a thoroughbred. Why are they not had the thoroughbred? That's like the most common, common horse breed, I swear. Just bumped into a friend, actually. She's just got an x race horse. Lovely, lovely, sensible horse, which is kind of cool. Uh, this Cremello uh, female, I don't know what your stats are. They're quite good, but I might need to... I mean, I'm a sucker for a Cremello, and it's a, it's a Mustang, too. Uh, let's just put her in the wild brumby section and see what happens because oh I haven't even got that one a name that one needs a name I don't think I'm gonna keep that one so we're not gonna worry let's check this brumby one out Ooh. yeah we'll just move him to the brumby section as well let's do that so when you guys are playing horse reality do you section them in like colors like why are you playing the game why are you playing the game <laughs> to get the highest GP what are you doing oh this one's got a rare color and it's I got 11 very good oh my good lord Oh my goodness! So let's take your GP. That's not the best GP. And who's your parents? Ah, oh, Snowball. That's cute. Oh, I sound so stupid today. Sorry, guys. I want a name for this one, chaps. Uh, so that's number two. So let's go. Uh, Eleven. Very good. Um, yeah, I just wish we could have like more stables. I do have like Delta points, but I like spending the Delta points on. So if you go to a state, you can buy more stables but i need these delta points for this uh care for all button which i love crikey when did we get so many foundation tickets again let's go on to the foundation bits so i'm a sucker for an altique as well how do you say that? altique arabians i love i don't know what the brabant horses are but they look nice hmm i love fjords but i the, again like i said to you guys the reason i play anything is for variation in coat color I did do Irish horses originally, because you guys know I have Irish horses in real life. If you haven't checked, if you don't know that I have Irish horses in real life, then I don't know what you're doing. You need to go and see my real life stuff. I actually have a playlist, playlist called Lady Ranger Real Life. This is another 11, very good. This needs another name. So number three. This one's gorgeous, because it's Palomino. So cute. Cookie as well, for Cookie, that's nice. Might sell off some of my old, older horses, maybe, so you guys can enjoy them. And the rest are Mustangs, so let's move you into Wild Brumbies. Oh, not Mustangs, Brumbies, I'm being really stupid. Sorry, I keep calling them Mustangs. 
kind of see Brumbies and Mustangs as the same thing. Now, some smart Alec is probably going to give me a list of reasons why that is not the case, but hey ho, I don't care. Uh, let's go to achievements. Oh, now the reason I'd keep that is because of the colouring, but he's a stallion, so guys, I'll sell him. You guys can, you guys can go and enjoy him. Lovely, lovely job, <laughs> lovely job, lovely job. I just don't remember how, when all these foals suddenly aged up. Oh, another Cromello. Oh, 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 check your achievements, bud. Oh, 11, 12, 10 very good, 10 very good, but slightly higher on the old, uh, on the old GP. So let's go horse market. You guys can buy him off me. I'm going to probably sell quite a few stallions, actually. But this is probably the way I made the most money on my game. As I said to you guys in the last video of Horse Reality, like how to get rich, just get some good stallions. Oh, 11, very good. This is mare as well. So this is number four. This is going to need a name. So this is 11, very good. We'll put you into best mares. Oh, this is getting silly how many horses I have. Because if you look at the estate as well, if we go here, I have 70. So I have like 20 horses, too many. Whoops. Whoopsie, whoopsie, whoopsie. Ah, oh, this is nice as well. Okay, well, this one, uh, this number five needs a name. Let's go VG... Very, oh, 11, very good. Come on, little brain, keep up. So, love this. Again, some of these will be for sale eventually, I think. I think I'm going to have to sit down and really think about what I am doing in my life. Chestnuts. I, do you know what? I don't see a chestnut very often at the moment. don't know why. Oh, he's 11, very good as well. He's going to get sold, but he's 11, very good, to be fair. What's his lineage? Let's check his lineage. And he gets first... Oh... Hold the phone. He could produce some cool colours. Okay, well what we'll do, I'll give some of the opportunity to enjoy him. As much as I'd like to keep this one, I've got to think about that stable block. Because if those thoroughbreds come along, I'd quite like enough space in the stable block where I can afford where I can afford a thoroughbred. Just to show you guys the new breed. I don't know where the news is, actually. Oh, this is another one by, because I used this new stallion someone gave me. Wow, he's nice too. Let's put, is this a female? Uh, yeah, we will sell her actually, so you guys can enjoy her. As she's a mare, it'd be a little bit more expensive. But you know, the other day, guys, I accidentally put fifty thousand as a buyout instead of five uh, five thousand. Somebody bought the horse for fifty thousand, even though I messed up. I was like, oh, well, that's that's sold then. I was like, oh, okay. Oh, what am I doing? I don't know. I sound so stupid today. I sound like Donald Duck, actually. <gasps> 12, very good. It's a stallion. It's 12, very good. That's going straight in my basket. Okay. 12, very good. Um, this one needs a really cool name. So I'll leave you guys. I've got a brand new stallion that needs a name. Let's put him in literally my top studs. Hey, so we've got my top studs and we also have other studs as well. Oh my gosh, guys, look at him. He's so gorgeous. Why is he so nice? That's not the one. <laughs> that this is the one. I just want to check his lineage. I don't know what colour he is. I think we should do a genetics test on him. Let's do that. Let's do that now. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I literally got this cold off all my students. I was like, thank you guys. You're brilliant. So he's like a splash. So is he a bay? If you're carrying I don't know. He's, sil he's got a silver gene. <laughs> I just like saying stuff that's, that's like bolded here or capitalised. Oh, McGee. So he's a bay splash roan doodah silver thing. If somebody could put that into uh, correct English for me, that would be wunderbar. Thank you. Okay, Ah, oh, he's from Gladfort Legends. And from Bieber. I can't remember Bieber having like really good stats. Hang on. There she is. Ah. Oh. Well, I'm pretty amazed at that. So he's a whole new bloodline, luckily, so that's really good, because I don't want, like, inbreeding to happen, because that's bad. Captain Jack Sparrow, guys, one of the best we have. He's awesome. He is up for stud, if you want to go check that out. One last foal, then, and it's a cool coloured one. What colour are you? Sorry, guys, I'm moving in my big granddad chair. Um, he's lovely. He's got ten very good as well. It's not too bad. He's from Fort, uh, Glad Fort Led Legends as well. I might change the name just because I can't read it because I'm a bit simple at times. Uh, start basic training. Uh, genetics. He's got good genetics as well. I think I was breeding more for the genetics, you know. Let's put this one up. You guys can go and enjoy him. Now, he is good, so he's going to be a bit more expensive, guys. Not much, but a bit. Okay. Oh, he's lovely. 
Blue eyes as well, I think, there. Can't quite see, but you know. So, all of these up for sale. Why are you in the wrong bits? Let's put you in this one. So, if I sell all of those, hopefully that, that'll give us enough stables to like sort out what we're doing. Maybe I should. Oh, what's going on here? Nope. My mouth sometimes like randomly does random stuff. Moana is gorgeous. The best horse that I did breed. If we go to. Oh no. Have I got more in the. Oh, I've got one horse left. Oh, crikey. Okay. Um, we need a name for number one, but I will put number one in the foal pasture. Oh, crikey. Because we're going to run out of room. Where are all these other foals? <laughs> are they the Brumby ones? Are these all Brumbies, these? Oh, okay. I don't know if Brumbies were a good idea, but I love the colour variations on them. That's the only thing. Oh, what do we do? What do we do? Okay, Ariel's really nice. So Ariel's quite a nice looking horse, I must admit. She's wicked, actually. What is the best way to, like, if you... Okay, how do I explain this? Um, if you had, like, no way of breeding with a higher achievement, you know, or a higher genetic horse. Genetic is not a word, but... Um, yeah... Um, I'll start, um, I'm just trying to think, like, how would you, if on the game, if you just used your own horses, is it that higher trained horses produce better foals? Tell me, guys, tell me the secret to this. Let's go explore for a while. Don't know why we need to explore, but I've run out of stables, which really is quite annoying. Okay, let's have a look. Guys, this cold is driving me mental today. So, I went to the university and I'm studying a course. Hmm. Craig, I thought I already did this. Ah, oh, so what do I do? Today is decisions. I need your help with the decisions on what I do with these guys. Do I sell everything and restart and start with the thoroughbred breed when it comes out in six? I kind of don't want to get rid of these. I might just keep really good foals. Uh, really good studs, sorry. Oh, it's so hard. Decisions. Decisions. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty... Like, do I get rid of... Not get rid of, that's a horrible way of putting it. But do I sell all my Brumbies? I just don't know what to do. What a stunning. I love her. So I just don't know what to do next. Let's see where... Is there anywhere that says Thoroughbred's coming out next? Let's have a look. Where's like news? If we go on to news, rankings, registries, uh, Delta store, I'll be on. Oh, there's a big thing here that says news. So let's have a look. Community update. New Icelandic greys. Ooh. <laughs> what have we got? Community update. New Icelandic greys and other bugs. Blah, blah, blah. Competition scoring. Server struggles. Thoroughbreds. I don't know how they put that like in the middle. That should be number one. Thoroughbreds. Today's update is a war on bugs. What bug? I've got bugs, that's why I got cold. Ha ha ha! New competition scores seem too high. Okay, recent server struggles. Oh, he's a nice, that's nice artwork. Is that a gypsy banner? That's lovely. Ah, thoroughbreds will arrive. Next update on the 6th of October, the thoroughbreds will arrive. Are you ready for the big rush? Only two weeks left, the thoroughbreds will join horse reality. Our server will be temporarily unavailable <gasps> while this update bolts out of the starting gates. Ooh, a lovely weapon. But we should be uh, back up pretty quickly. If you're hoping for a head start, Ooh. Thoroughbreds release uh, will put a lot of strain on an already hardworking server. It's best to prepare for some lag. It's just due to a thundering hooves, thousands. <laughs> yeah, tell us about it. We play Rival Stars. As you guys know, some Thoroughbreds will be added with colour genes. They are known to have in real life, with the exception of those kit jeans. I don't know what kit jeans are. Ooh, marked. So we don't have uh, that. We don't have uh, in game. That's all. Like, what? Where does this take me? Does it take me to a whole new, a whole new world? Ooh, horse breeds, artwork, and genetics. Oh my crikey! This is cr This is too much for my little brain. Oh wowza! Okay. Oh, I need to kind of save this. This has got all the uh, 
all the details in. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's for another video, I think. My brain can't handle that today with this cold. Ah uh ha -huh. Oh no. The very last horse breed to be released in our foundation system. We plan to fundamentally change the way our foundations work. Why? And most recently discussed here. Those plans still underway, but progress at a slower pace since preparations for the merge took over. Thoroughbreds will continue to be available after the foundation receives its update. The new foundation will be expected somewhere after the merge. What merge? What merge? I don't know what's going on. Market redesign. Oh, cute. Okay, I don't have a clue. Uh, what's going on? I want to look at what's announced here. Today, dear players, we celebrate the arrival of a fitting room. I don't care about fitting rooms. Um, <laughs> ooh, I am a premium player. Premium player should last for a year, not for a month, though. Unless they're going to change that. Or if I have it wrong, which is highly likely. So what's going on then? I don't really know. Guys, what's happening in horse reality? I can't be bothered to read all this. I don't know what's going on. So why? So very long-term goals. Transferring the game to version 2. Right. That's that's kind of good though. And there's going to be a version 2. Ah. Brabants. We already have those, don't we? Huh. Maybe they're new. Thoroughbreds will arrive in the moment. Yeah. Great. So this is actually the foundation. I did not know that. Third fountain generation. Right, well that's that guys. Ooh, players will purchase horses that pedigrees. Oh, foundations are... This is crazy. So here's all the stuff here. Players will purchase horses without pedigrees, blah blah blah. Foundation will only have a limited number of horses each breed that replenish once per week. That's kind of a good idea actually, because that'll make it harder. Every player will see their own foundation store, meaning the horses you see for sale are not visible to anyone else. That's really good. There will be a system in place that makes sure that rare coloured genes spawn less often. Yes, that's good. I think that's kind of the issue I'm having with... I mean, well, I don't know. Qu qu quarter horses are kind of done in the game now. I think I'm a bit late on that. Both bulls and adults will be offered at the Foundation Breeder. Ah, you can get bulls too. Here's what we currently envision. A player visits the Foundation Breeder to see, see a few available horses per breed. Some are foals, some are adults. Most common colours select a rare co seldom a rare colour. The player can preview them based on looks, how much it looks, um, works, wait what, the player can preview them based on looks, much like it works at the wildlife park, oh okay, I just kind of take every one I see at the wildlife park, <laughs> once the player decides to buy the horse, the system generates all of the horse's traits and places them in the player's estate. If the player continues to buy horses of that breed, the foundation breeder of that continent will temporarily go out of stock for the breed, oh okay, that makes sense, for that player only, okay. In the following week, new stock will be available. Ah! If the player just never buys the preview horses of a breed, those will still get replaced weekly. Oh, okay. This is so good. As for traits of these horses, there will be a range of each stat that the team has chosen. Oh, okay. The wildlife parks will mostly stay the way they are. Great. This looks brilliant. The future of horse reality looks super. I would be so up for supporting the game financially. I really would. It's a brilliant game. The team is super, the artwork's incredible, the jeans are genius. Well done, you guys. Who actually made the game? I should probably... Ah, DeLorean. DeLorean, of course it's DeLorean, because you have an art channel as well, don't you? Unless I have that wrong. Absolutely blooming brilliant. So guys, go over to Horse Reality. You know, even if... I don't, I don't want to say, like, spend your money, but support the game. Support the game as much as you can. We need games like this. They're very, very rare. Like, there's no good horse games out there. This is one of the best. I will be playing a horse Eden eventing soon because it is so good too. Also hunt and jump, but that like messes with my little tiny brain. So we've got loads of online horse games that are free and they're really, really fun and easy to play. And this has definitely been the one that I've kind of hooked on the most. Yeah, I just think it plays well, you know? So go and support the game guys. Okay, I think that's it for today. So I just wanted to show you a couple of our new stallions. Oh, we've got Jerry here as well. <laughs> He's not quite as exciting. I don't know what colour he is. Is he a dun? Dun dun dun. I don't know. You guys can tell me all these things. Maybe we should do a video on how all the genes work. <laughs> I'll, need a, I'll need a couple of weeks to prepare for that though. <laughs> I guess I can't handle it. Okay guys, have a awesome day. Make sure you subscribe. Turn on your notification bell. And please like the video if uh, you've enjoyed me waffling on for a bit. So, 
Um, if we get to 20,000 subs, guys, I'm gonna go live. Hopefully we'll start a Twitch account and all that kind of shebang too. Yeah. Okay, guys, have a awesome day. Thanks for everything. Bye.